Uh, it's been a dreary Monday. Good nap day, right? Uh, yesterday was as well. Uh, the last two days, rain total, Fond du Lac at almost two and a half inches. Sheboygan, about an inch and three quarters, close to that. Cedarburg, Port, Grafton, about an inch and a quarter. Menominee Falls, under an inch. Whitefish Bay, about six tenths. And then Racine, Milwaukee, and Kenosha, about a quarter to a third of an inch. So more to the north. And there were some heavy, heavy downpours earlier this morning. That tapered off around noon. And it's been cloudy and some patchy fog since then. We just had a few scattered rain showers. Milwaukee, south side, Racine, and Kenosha County the past uh, hour and a half or so. That's all moved out over the lake. But there's more down to the south. There's just a very isolated chance for a shower uh, throughout the evening. But with some fog developing, you could could see some drizzle and of course much cooler temperatures. There's the front. It has now sagged to the south of Milwaukee. The severe weather is down to the south of us, but until this completely moves through this evening, we still have that slight chance of rain. But once again, the fog and the drizzle uh, is also a concern. Tomorrow's weather, sunshine. Wednesday's weather, more rain. Uh, here's your chance for rain this evening of less than 20%, but then around 10, 11, 12 o'clock, you get this little bump as that system pushes on through and then it moves out. You'll have some fog overnight tonight, but it should be out of here uh, by the morning. A high of 76 at four o'clock. We were still 72. That's not the case anymore. A year ago today, we were 90 degrees at this hour in Waukesha. Cloudy, no rain, 66. The dew point's still up there at 61, so it's muggy outside. The humidity at 83%. But look what's happened to Milwaukee in just the last, let's say, 45 minutes. Temperatures have dropped into the upper 50s from the low 70s. Racine's starting to cool down, so is Burlington still holding on to the 70s, though, from Kenosha to Janesville. But as that front continues to sag to the south, the temperatures will take a dive as well, and the fog will develop. Nice Tuesday outside with some sunshine, rainy Wednesday, and a great looking Thursday, so plan accordingly. Tonight, uh, the rain moves out before 1 a.m. Just those few showers will drop down to around 50 degrees with a little bit of patchy fog. By afternoon, some sunshine, a high of 68 around the noon hour, and then we'll start to cool down near the lakefront in the afternoon uh, as you get that light northeast wind developing. Tomorrow, a good day to do some yard work. Wednesday is not. Thursday, also a great day to do some yard work. You can see in the future forecast, tonight's fine or tomorrow morning is fine. Tomorrow throughout the day is fine. Wednesday, more showers and heavy downpours roll in, not expecting any severe weather. By tonight, or tomorrow morning, I should say, we'll wake up into the low to mid 50s by afternoon. Upper 60s in Milwaukee, cooler at the lake and low 70s inland. Here's your seven day forecast. Rainy and 64 for Wednesday. Beautiful on Thursday at 75. Just a spotty shower on Friday. The weekend's dry and near 70.